Hello Prima Lovers, Adrian here with an Altered Heart tutorial using the new Avec Amour collection which is full of gorgeous pastels and floral elements. I'm using the Sweet Roses paper to cover half of this wooden heart, so start by tracing it out on the back side that is lighter, allowing you to see your pencil lines. After tracing out the heart, cut the shape out, then tear it in half straight down the middle. We aren't going to waste this gorgeous paper, so to layer the pink and white pattern underneath, tear off another section. Trace and trim off the excess on the second piece, then distress the cut edges of both papers with a blade or distressing tool. Glue down the pieces of paper to the wooden heart using soft gloss gel. To give it a little dimension, gently curl the torn sides up with your fingers. Cut a few floral elements from the bonus sheet in the 12 by 12 paper pad. You can use whatever tools you like best, but I prefer swivel craft knife and self-healing craft mat. Then trim the white halo off the bird ephemera piece. Apply a floral rub-on transfer from the collection so that it is tucked just under the paper. I'm using a couple of the molds from the collection that I pre-cast in resin. Start by painting your molds with white gesso, then apply watered down impasto paint in Victorian green to the frame. Before the paint dries, Wipe the paint off of the raised areas with a soft cloth or baby wipe. You can see that I also painted a chipboard heart in the same color impasto paint. For the bow and jewels, use the same technique but with impasto paint in boudoir pink. To add a little more detail and shimmer to these molds, use some opal magic paints in blue gold and pink blue. Adding this detail, especially on the bow and jewels, really helps to bring out that texture in these gorgeous molds. Now that all of your elements are ready, it's time to start putting on flowers, molds, and ephemera. I like to use heavy body gel as it gives me some work time to adjust placement of my elements. Start by adding in your base layer of flowers and tuck in some of the ephemera. Then add the smaller jewel molds to the center of some of the smaller flowers. Don't forget to tuck in a few of the smaller flowers to really fill this project out. the frame mold on top of the flowers, then layer the chipboard heart on top using a heavy body gel. Add the bow mold to the top of the frame. Tuck in some lace drops and add the top layer of flowers. Use a little foam adhesive to pop the bird ephemera onto the chipboard heart. Add the larger tool mold to the center of the largest flower on top of your cluster when you're done. Let's add a little bling by adhering some memory hardware pearls to some of the flowers with heavy body gel and popping on some crystals from the Avec Amour collection.
for some additional shabby chic vibes, dry brush some gesso over your flowers. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you in the next one.